And they all count the same, right? I mean, um, it's one of the more frustrating we've had in a, in a really long time. So, um, you know, one of those deals where it didn't help ourselves. Um, but uh, like I said, the timing wasn't great for it, but we haven't had many of those at all, and we move forward. Did that frustration come from some of the walks there, just continuing to come around for rounds, especially after you get the hater? Yeah, exactly. I mean, that's the, that's the big part of it, you know, the... Um, you know, Jack's cruising, throwing well, you know, and he goes out and gets the first out, and Jed makes a really nice play on the back end down the line. Um, and then a walk and hit batter and went out just to kind of help him regroup a little bit, just kind of get a pulse for what he was feeling. And um, also thought it was a good opportunity for him to, to compete right there. And Jack's going to do that. It's a good learning opportunity for him. Um, he needed to get that opportunity and, you know, another, another walk and, Kind of like the bat against Shaw with him, really, actually, based on the previous at bats. So, um, and you know, I had to go to earmarked for for Braun, and you know, didn't make a few pitches, obviously, and was able to get it, keep it right there, and, and we went went from there. What did you see uh, on the ball hit to Jose Martinez in the outfield? That's a that's a tough one to read. It's a there. tough one, you know. He's trying to make a play, so you can't fault a guy for trying to make a play. You know, he feels like he can he can catch it right there, and he's going at it hard. I mean, listen, Jose's done a nice job for a long time in the outfield, and to the point where sometimes you know we go put him, you know, a defensive guy out there and begin to think about like you know well, he's been carrying the mail he's been doing his job he's positioned well he's getting good jumps he's made a great play on that backup that you know jed deked and you know we had time called but um he didn't make a play trying to make a play and that's going to happen you know we're not going to fault him for that um clearly that didn't work out and you know lead off triple and try to navigate around it but um you know he tried to make a play one of those in between plays and got by him what was the explanation on the time? You rarely see that when players aren't on the bases. Yeah, you don't see it very often. Um, he basically said that because the ball was wet, he wanted to call time. Did he, did he see Arcia off the bag? Did he... I can't answer that. When you when I try to pick knock us off first, did you see a play developing there um, where he tried to keep him close? Yeah, just, just seeing what's going on. and. Um, you know, obviously, um, you know, a little frustrating. You know, ball hit him, got away, and we we should shouldn't have to worry about picking the first base. That wasn't that, that wasn't a call pickoff, was? Was it? Or is that something that he saw that he was calling for? Himself? No, we called it. Okay. Pick off. We, I take full responsibility for it. To get to hate or the way you guys did, what was the did it feel at that point that momentum is shifting in a good direction? Yeah, absolutely. We felt that way. And, um, you know, we get the lead. And, um, you know, we've got Jordan who hadn't pitched in a couple of days. And I um, feel like it was a nice spot for him. And we'd off hit and, you know, walk. And then was able to get out of it. But still, you know, the run came across to tie it back up. So, um, yeah, definitely some momentum back on our side. And those are big swings. You know, Ozzy, big swing for the homer. And, Ozuna hit a missile out here for the two-run homer to give us the lead, and you know you definitely feel like momentum's on your side at that point. And unfortunately, we weren't able to um, keep it on our side. Uh, without that delay, were you going to send Hicks back out in the eighth, or was that no, going to be about those? No, that was going to be it. Just yeah. because the lefties. Correct. Know. Yeah, we knew they were going to hit Thames and had it set up, and just um, like I said, you know, didn't make a play, and um, ball got away first, and that's it. Hicks did get ground balls. He when, did. When the balls were bad. Yeah, walks he got his ground balls, and that's the thing, you know, we trust him. That's why you're sitting there, and Paul made an excellent play on the on the ball that, you know, ended up getting a, the, the tie and run. Um, you know, that was a big-time play. Moon just made a nice play as well. You know, you're sitting there, base loaded, and you know um, he's a pitch away from, from getting that ground ball, and like you said, Payne's ball went in, and that ball, you know, just kind of squirted through. But if it's at somebody, it's, you know, we're out of the inning. So um, that's a... That's what you have with Jordan. You have a guy that can make pitches and, and get quick outs. And, um, you know, unfortunately, the walks, you know, hurt you. Anytime you give up something in a competition, it usually hurts you. How hard is the balance of Jordan to keep him rested and to keep him kind of in flow to where maybe that touch is a little more there for him? Well, I mean, September's been his least worked month all year. I mean, you know, so we feel pretty good about being able to do it. But we also recognize that he's healthy. And, um, yeah, we want to make sure we take care of all our guys. and. I feel like, again, this month, not a lot of back-to-backs, easier workload. Um, 
but the reality is, you know, we got he's got to pitch when it's appropriate to pitch him. And um, tonight was an appropriate time, and feels fine. The ball's coming out still pretty good, 100, 103. So, <laughs> um, you know, just didn't quite execute like we needed to tonight. Silver lining of this, hitting the, the hater like you guys did, he's been pretty untouchable for a while. Um, yeah, I suppose you can, you know, always in the half class, half full guy, but you know, it's a little harder um, when you feel like you, you kind of um, didn't didn't take care of your own business and when it was there. But um, our, our guys compete regardless who's pitching, and we appreciate the competition um, and appreciate what's going on. And we're, I know this group's excited to compete tomorrow. Thank <laughs> you.